Hello, everyone, and thank you for tuning in. My name is Brandon Wrights from Houston, Texas. I'm a senior applications engineer with Olympus, specializing in our advanced UT products. In this short video, we'll go through the process of managing files on the OmniScan X3. That includes creating, saving, and transferring files. File management on the X3 is done in one central, easy to access location. It's located at the top center of the screen, titled by the small folder icon. By clicking the file menu, you get the drop down menu uh, where we can open files, uh, create new setup files, save our setup, uh, configure the file name for your data file. The indication table, a file manager will we'll use to transfer files and uh, edit files, as well as your report. Uh, you can configure your report here as well. So first we'll start out by creating a new setup. So we'll go to the drop down, select new. Uh, for this example, we're not gonna save our current setup. So we'll select no. It's always good practice to start with a fresh setup file when you're configuring a new inspection technique. So as soon as you get your new file loaded, you go to, typically you come in, configure your scan plan, your UT settings, all that. And the next step on the file management side will be to save that setup. So we'll go to the drop down menu and we'll select save setup as. So with the on-screen keyboard, we can type in a setup name here. So we can go demo one, and we'll press the, press the check mark here to save that setup. So once the setup saves, you can see the file name change here. So we configured a new setup, saved our setup. We can come in here into the file name. So here you set the name for your data file. So uh, you can create a custom name if you're, you know, if you're inspecting a vessel, you can put the code there, however you want to do that. And as well as uh, we can manage the indication table and the report in the file menu. So that can either be done on the, the X3 or through Omni PC, uh, totally up to you. But uh, the next step would be to come in here to the file manager. So inside the file manager, we, uh, we can use it to edit files, uh, open files, as well as transfer files. So uh, the, for the most part, you're probably using this screen to transfer your data files. So say you want to review it on your PC with Omni PC, or even uh, transfer your Creek pre-configured setup files to another X3. So on um, the first drop-down box here on the top left, we can select where uh, we want to pull files from. So whether we want to pull it from the X3's internal hard drive or an external drive, either a USB stick or an SD card if we want to transfer files to the instrument. So we'll come in here, we'll select X3, and say we want to transfer a data file to a USB drive to review the data with Omni PC. So we can select the drop-down and select data. So here you can see all your data files. So now on the bottom, you want to select transfer. And from the transfer screen, we can select the data files we want to transfer. So you can either transfer one or multiple files. We'll select these two files here. In the center here, we see our destination drive. So we get our USB flash drive inserted in the X3. And then we press copy to. As soon as this loads, the screen disappears. That means the files were transferred successfully. So we can press done to get out of the transfer screen and done one more time to get out of the file manager. If we want to open a safe setup file, so if we want to maybe perform a similar inspection technique to a pre-configured setup we made, we can come in here and say, let's open this A32 automated setup, and we can select open. So that's the basics uh, file management on the X3. It's uh, quite simple, easy to use. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to post it in the comments section and share this video. Thank you.